You get stuck in your fucking head, bad thoughts, good thoughts, all the thoughts, tired of it, I got you. First of all, you're not your fucking thoughts. Thoughts are electrical events that occur within the wakeful, lucid field of mind. Mind is born of a thing. We call it consciousness. I don't really like calling it anything, but here we are using words and shit, so consciousness it is for now. The field of consciousness, not to be confused with the thought plane or thoughts, is equally distributed throughout your meat tractor. The thought plane creates like an aperture, let's say a hole in a vast dam. Behind that dam is a lake of consciousness spread equally throughout your body, pushing through this tight hole where it picks up thoughts. You don't see the dam. All you see is the thought stream. We get stuck in our head because the tremendous force of consciousness attempting to emerge creates an incredible one-way pressure that shoots through that hole, and thus, you think you are. So here's a practice. Become aware of yourself, aka consciousness, within your body. Start with your hands. Do you feel yourself in there? That's you, unburdened by thought. That's the lake of consciousness within you as it presents in your hands. Spread your awareness up your arms, shoulders, scalp, down your back, down the crack of your ass, all the places. You get the idea. See how much of yourself you are aware of inside your skin. Are you aware of your toes? How about your earlobes? Armpits, don't forget your taint. See what I'm saying? The more diffused your attention is in your body, the less it's in your damn head. By doing this, you're practicing lowering the pressure shooting through the thought plane, and you're getting in touch with what you really are and have always been. This need not be limited to meditating. You can and should practice it whenever, whilst doing shit. Use your sense organs to bring your attention into your body. Feel wind on your skin or feel the clothing where it touches you. See every sight, hear every sound without labeling them or creating a narrative. Keep your attention in the body and out of the thought plane. Whatever you're doing, feel gravity's hug as a pressure between foot and ground or ass and seat. Smell every smell, allow every pain or delight or itch or whatever the fuck as it comes and goes. If you're too damn in your head to meditate, I recommend this practice. Every now and again, reality gives us a glimpse and we tend to instantly fuck it up by encapsulating it in a thought narrative. Regular meditation or this type of meditation will help weaken your addiction to thought. So when the glimpse comes, you can take a bite of it. And if you can get through the thought withdrawals and get your mind clean, then you can expand the practice to outside of your skin. That'll have to be another fucking episode. First things first, take care of your physical body because if it hurts or is uncomfortable or fucked up because you do dumb shit, it's too much of a distraction to practice what I'm talking about. If you're a head person, get in your body. If you're a body person, get in your head. Observe your thoughts. Figure it the fuck out. The answers lie within. And when you start getting those glimpses, you'll see that within is also without. Consider that consciousness is not generated in your wrinkly pink meat computer or your meat tractor. Consciousness is a vast, ineffable ocean, and you are but a wave. You got this, boo? Toodaloo.